Hey guys, this is Cloudy Ratohor and as per the promise in previous tutorial, in this tutorial we will play with the loops and in this tutorial we will play with while loop. Uh, if you know about the while loop, that while loop repeats as long as a certain boolean condition is met. So let's play with the same. Now to play with the while loop, suppose if I have uh, a count of uh, zero number. And uh, I want to check the count two five colon and print count and then print the same uh, increment the loop uh, sorry increment the counts count equals to count plus one now try to execute the same so i hope it will print the number from uh, up to four oh. oh we forward to q equals now uh, execute the same so it's starting from the zero up to the 4 so it prints the number up to 4 but uh, dear all sometimes we require to break something means uh, as usual we uh, we need to break the records too but uh, uh, in python tutorial the break is uh, used to exit a uh, for loop or a while loop where continue uh, is used to skip the uh, current block and uh, return to the for or while statement now instead of talking about the same just see uh, where to use break and uh, continue for example suppose i have the same uh, uh, same example uh, now just try to change the uh, little bit not true now print the same print count and now increment the counter equals to count plus one and now check if count is greater than or equals to say five so break the same so as soon as it's check uh, it uh, it uh, check for the greater than or equals to 5 when it's found true then it will break the same now try to execute the same now try to change some different number so that we can find out the uh, changes in the same so now you can see here we print the number from 1 to 8 now change the same thing again now so it prints the number from 1 to 11 so sometimes we, re we need to break but sometimes we need to continue still now to understand the continue now change the uh, program for example for uh, x in range uh, say 12 and uh, Check for the same if x take the mod mod operator and two equals to equals to zero. Now continue and print the result. Now try what it will produce. So, it print the number first 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 and 11. So, it continues only uh, so it continues uh, if some number and uh, uh, some number gives the remainder 0 then it continues otherwise it print the, print the number. So, we, we know if if we 
divide the 1 with uh, 2 so we will not get uh, 0 as a remainder in the same same, same way uh, if we divide the number 3 5 7 9 11 so it will never gives the remainder 0 and that's why it prints the number so guys in next tutorial we will play with some more example with more functions till then see ya